fiberglassing in the holes that um, we had cut to relieve some of the pressure on the corners. And after this we'll be painting it all in red and it'll all look smooth. We'll sand it down so we don't have these uh, fiberglass bits hanging off and that's all. Basically it is a concrete toboggan. Uh, anything that touches the running surface has to be concrete. The GNCTR Great Northern Concrete Toboggan Race was started in the 70s. UFC and U of A had to do a joint run in 75 and then SAIT sent four teams and one. The roll cage is designed to be rolled over at 80 kilometers so we want to try and test that. Um, well, we're, we're we plan for 80, but uh, the actual dynamic impact is about 50. So when we uh, start skidding sideways, we'll shed some speed, and then uh, hopefully we won't crush. Uh, the steering is kind of cattywampus. Um, there's a third ski attached on a caster bearing, and then when you turn the handles like this, there's gas shocks that push the ski back and forth. The brakes are a little, uh, a little leaves them to be desired, but um, they don't work that quickly, so they're on there. I mean, at the very least, there's hay bales at the end of the course that will slow us down pretty quickly. No, I'm going directly down no, no. this alley. Over right here. No. It's perfect. Uh -uh. It's better than yep. your alley because you won't go that way and hit the bumps. Who's driving? So am I going to have to ride this thing in the front every time? Yeah. 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 <laughs> no one else will fit. Ready? You guys ready? Push. One, one, two, three. Woo, go Saints! Oh, we drifted oh, that we shit. Drift. The brakes work pretty good this time, actually. Damn. I had, this, is my, this is my job. Uh, I don't have a life beyond the sled. So it's going to be a pretty big payoff in Edmonton uh, next week.